All new at six, it's crunch time for supporters of Sacramento State's effort to build two new sports venues in their pursuit of joining the Pac-12 Conference. And finally, the people in deep pockets to make it happen. That's the question. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Marley Ginter. Let's get to Steve Large, who's tracking this, the latest on the push for the Pac-12. Sacramento State is now marching towards a new kind of end game. Seeking to score an entry into the Pac-12 conference, in part by building a new football stadium. This helmet is the one from the engineering construction management program. Sacramento State alum and city council member Eric Guerra is going all in to support construction. A new Sac State feasibility study shows the school would need to build a new football stadium. One estimate puts it $300 million and a new basketball arena at an estimated $225 million. And I'm getting the sense that this is happening very quickly. This opportunity is, uh, I think, one in a lifetime for the university because the Pac-12 is trying to stay in the West Coast. Some of the same groups that work to build momentum to keep the NBA in Sacramento by building the Golden One Center are also behind this effort to build up Sac State Athletics. But this is different because uh, I see this as an opportunity to grow our institution that's creating more opportunities for other kids. For now, financing the proposed construction costs would come from Sac State student fees, a network of alumni, and boosters. Some notable deep pocket Sac State alumni include Tom Hanks, director Ryan Coogler, who played football at Sac State, Dale Carlson, founder of Sleep Train, and the prolific developer Angelo Sakopoulos. As Sacramento State seeks to build its brand, building these new athletic facilities is now part of the plan. And we are live inside Hornet Stadium right now. This stadium built back in 1969. And once again, Pac-12 saying it's just not big enough to match their standards as the Hornets uh, practice and get ready for their next game, which, by the way, is another whole facet of this uh, Sacramento State asking folks in this city to pack these stands. 15,000 is what they're looking for for the rest of the remainder of the season. Uh, Pac-12, they're adding teams for the start of the 2026 season, but uh, the decision on who to invite could come as soon as the next couple of months. Sac State wants to be on that list. Yeah, pivotal time. College sports, it's a business, that's for sure. All right, Steve, thank you. Live at Sac State.